We've got tips and recipes for healthy living. So for fun and inspiration, come and join us in the raw food world. Welcome everybody, this is Matt Monarch with the Raw Food World TV show. And today is April 2nd and it is Thursday. And we're sitting here on our land with the lovely Angela and Irie. And uh, Irie was about to explain to us how we're gonna make this place a wonderland. Okay. <laughs> Tell us what you see. I've got a sketchbook here. So Matt, if you look kind of behind us there, if you just look over here. Sure, this is the road up here. You can see the road elevation. So what we're proposing to do is put our floor level, all, it, it's almost at our eye level as we're standing here. So I'm just gonna get this book out here. So this would all get filled in. Filled in with what? Yeah. With soil of some kind. So that like from there, from where the road is, it just comes out like that, like a platform. So like out here. Wow. And we build the house on top of that platform. And it'll, and it'll be soil underneath us. So check this out, Matt. This is what we got so Ooh. far. So this is the, over here is the lot. You can see the road here. Yeah. And we got the river down here and the river is actually flowing in that direction. Sure. Bamboo forest over in the left hand corner there. So we're talking about coming off of the road right, right about in the middle here and creating a zone that's filled, filled up above where we're standing to the height of the road. Wow. Okay, you got that? Got but that. But this, this is the river. Oh, we got it the wrong way around? Yeah. Okay. That way. We got it the wrong way around. Okay, so it's right in this zone that we're going to be filling. Yeah. And then we just want to look at this one. Oh yeah, so we got the river going that way, the road coming in here. So this would be like the zone that gets filled up to the road level and that would be the circle, inner the circle. circle. Yeah. So you're you're going through a gateway here. This is going to be about 45 feet across so it's it's room to get a car in turn around you could you could park a vehicle in there <laughs> oh my god um, and come back out but the idea is to have a really pure space in the center and we're going to investigate whether we can do these with um, do this curved wall with a rammed earth wall sure and then the um, the dwelling spaces are almost like built off of radiating spokes from the center of the circle so the main, the main residence would be here. The idea that I'm playing with for this, um, although I need to do some more drawings to show you how it's going to work, okay. is that this space here would be like an outside living room. Nice. So it has a roof over it, you can furnish it, but it's open to these garden terraces on both sides. Sure. So you actually walk through a little garden yeah. on your way in. And then we've got two closed off spaces at either end. Like this one is for sleeping. Wow. We have a couple of bedrooms and, and, wow. and bathrooms. And this one is for kitchen and food storage. This is all about food. This is all about comfort and relaxation and sleeping. And those are the only two enclosed rooms that we're going to have. Yeah. Now my thought for these is to make at least one of them into a tower so that it maybe has a... Uh, second floor loft but at least it has a roof terrace sure so from the roof terrace level you'd be actually looking right out into the trees so this whole thing is going to be surrounded by a food forest which is a full starting from full tree canopy which we see here down to lower fruit trees sure and then down to berry bushes and root crops and herb, herb layers and so on can we make an entire roof terrace this whole entire area well, this would be like a vaulted timber framed roof. Oh, okay. And these would be a combination of rammed earth got and it. concrete slab on top. Got it. So what's this? What do we got here? Okay, so we got a guest house over here and similar kind of construction where we've got um, kind of a rammed earth enclosure. Sure. But a big outside open living room. Wow. And these open living room spaces here, here, um, and another one over here would overlook... Um, vegetable gardens on these benches. So we'd step down a couple of feet onto the vegetable garden level. Sure. And then a couple of feet more 
down to this elevation here, which would be the food forest. Got it. And then we've we've just got Angela's yurt sketched in. Right on. There, <laughs> which would be kind of in the area right behind Angela there. <laughs> Right. Wow. So the thought, the thought with the road is that not only would we build this up, but we would pretty much completely screen it off with a living wall. Yeah. So Absolutely. So we create a fence there that would be um, made out of living trees with vines growing in between. So, so your view from the backside is completely blocked. So every, from every room in the raw food world, you'd be looking out at raw food. <laughs> the idea. Oh! Love it. And I love our river, the energy here. It just feels like home to me and Angela and I. And we're just, there's, to be honest with you, we got the best property at San Joaquin. I feel it through and through. It's amazing. I'm so excited about it. Oof! Check it out. Dun 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 dun. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, right. Let's should we head to Mike's? Sure. Alright, let's do it. Well, we're back at our hotel now and uh, playing on our computers right here in this extraordinary view that I was just showing you where the light is just coming through the clouds for the last bit of the day. Unbelievable. What's on the plan and agenda for tomorrow, baby girl? Oh, there's lots of exciting things tomorrow. Meeting... Um architect who's maybe going to actually manage the building of our home, meeting a hydrologist to examine the land, having a meeting with the other people who are taking care of land here, doing some laundry, getting right a on. bank account, <laughs> Yeehaw. drinking juice, drinking juice, eating fresh, ripe, gorgeous fruits. Yum. And this beautiful, precious being is... Angela Stokes. And Matt Monarch, just living inside the beauty. And we'll see you tomorrow at the Raw Food World TV show. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you again at the Raw Food World.